All right, right now I'm going to show you what comes in a jet kit. All right, first thing you're going to get some instructions. I'll explain a little bit of that later. And you're going to get a box that looks like this. All right, comes with a few parts. Comes with a screw. It's a wood screw. This doesn't do anything but get those caps off from your uh, pilot screws. There's going to be a metal cap and you just tap it, put this screw in the cap and then yank the screw out. It's like pulling a tooth. You can get those caps off. It's going to come with a couple springs. I have two springs because I had two carbs on my last bike. These are the Dynojet ones that I didn't use. But they go in on the top. There's a diaphragm and you'll see the stock spring and you replace it with this other spring. This is my stock parts and these are where my stock springs so they're a little weaker. The new ones are kind of stiffer. You're going to get a drill bit. It's still in the bag. You're going to need to do a little drilling in your carbs but don't be afraid it's not much. And you're going to get jets which are these in the bag okay I'll try to show you that up close this is what it looks like it's just a little brass piece that's threaded right and here's the stock needle okay and you can see how the stock needle fits into the jet goes up and down pretty simple huh and the springs on top that's bouncing up and down and the only other part you're gonna get is a new dyno jet needle and this has a little clip it has little spaces and it'll tell you where to put it if you put the clip further down it's gonna keep the needle higher so it's gonna be richer So here's the, the, the jet, the needle goes in here, and it pulls it out a little more. If you put the clip near, higher up, it's going to be leaner, so it's going to stay a little deeper in the jet. Make sense? Right? That's all there is to it. The instructions are in here. They'll tell you how to put it in. Really all you're doing is keep a note of how you took it apart. And it's got a little diagram here. It shows you the spring, this little retainer thing you do, and the, the washers and the clip, the needle, and I'll show you the slide hole where you get a drill in your carb. And that's all you really got to do.